Hello everyone, my name is Susan from the Children's Department of the Surrey Libraries. Today we're going to learn a simple project to do with science. You can find all of these ingredients in your kitchen. Give it a try at home. We are going to make a rainbow using items you have in your kitchen. First cut a strip of paper towel in half using your scissors. You only need one strip for this project. Then on one of the long edges, use watercolor markers to make a strip of blocks in the colors of the rainbow. I started off with blue and then I turned the paper towel around and I did blue on the other side. After this, I started adding in other colors. I added green, I added yellow, I added red, and then I added orange. And I did the same on the other side of the paper towel. Let the markers dry. If the paper towel is still wet with the ink, the experiment does not work so well. Then I added uh, water to two jars and I put the paper towel in the middle. Now watch as the water colors start to rise. The water rises leaving a rainbow trail. This takes about 15 minutes by the way. Paper towels consist of plant fibers and absorb water quite well. Once the water reaches the branch cavities between the fibers, it can rise up through the material. As the water moves forward, it lifts the dye molecules with it. After the colors climb up or meet in the middle, you have your very own rainbow. Other ways of making a rainbow is taping the top of a paper towel to a vertical surface wall. Or you may want to opt to create an arch using a small wooden dowel or pencil. Rest it lengthwise across an empty plastic container. Drape the paper towel strip across the dowel with the color edges just after touching the bottom of the container. This way requires both short ends to have colored edges. Experiment to see which brand of paper towel works the best. After the experiment, let your paper towel dry out. Laminate it to make a cool bookmark. Also try reading a book on rainbows like Nature's Light Show, Rainbows by Christian Rajak. You can get this at Surrey Libraries. Thank you for joining me for this science experiment. Hi again, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this science video. If you'd like to see more of these science videos, please join us on Wednesdays and Saturdays. We'll see you again. Bye.